Hi YouTube. I have missed you guys so much. I hate when I'm inconsistent with posting, but I have a few reasons why. Let's just dive into it. I wasn't planning on filming today. Let's just get it going. Okay, so first of all, where have I been? Um, I went to Paris with Karastas and then London with my best friend right after that. And I was planning to film out there and I left my freaking camera in an Uber. And um, that was on me. It was never returned. And um, so I didn't have a camera. Now break number two, the past few weeks, finally got a camera, which is great. But the past few weeks, I've posted it on Instagram, but I have been really, really, really struggling with insomnia. Um, I used to like not want to call it that because I used to just be like, no, I have sleep issues sometimes, like whatever. But um, lately it has been full blown um, insomnia. I went to bed um, at like, 5 30 or 6 30 this morning it's 11 now so i slept maybe three or four hours which is more than i've been getting but honestly in the past few weeks i think i've had like in the past three weeks i've probably had two nights of rest um like i just can't freaking fall asleep and it is so frustrating and like just holds me back I think I'm just tired, <laughs> but it holds me back from everything. But I thought, why not film today? Because I'm either, it's Saturday. <laughs> I thought either I'm just gonna sit around and hope I go to sleep tonight or film, which is what I love to do, so. <laughs> Ew, I'm so annoying. I hate when people cry on stuff, but I don't even know if I'll post this, whatever. God, I look <laughs> interesting. Um. But I know that so many people literally deal with it. I posted on <clears throat> I posted on my story like what do you guys do to help with insomnia and things like that and I got thousands and thousands of response responses and I read almost all of them just because honestly like you guys are always more helpful than like me googling something, you know, like friend of a friend kind of stuff. I need to chill out, ew. Like, I'm like a happy, fun, goofy, ew. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, you guys gave so many helpful tips and tricks and I've also tried so many things. Like, I'll just do a quick word vomit list, but like, obviously the magnesium, the melatonin, um, hot bath at night, cold shower at night, no screen time, no TV, um, different insomnia exercises, which are like the military method where you relax your whole body, face, mind, all that stuff, um, scenario based where you're like trying to chill out, circadian rhythm, which is clearly off, which is like the sun and stuff, looking at the sun directly in the morning as soon as you get up, not taking naps throughout the day, which I can't nap because I can't freaking sleep, so, um, no cap, no alcohol, um, cold rooms, travel, um, edibles, <laughs> breath work, different methods with different coaches, um, anxiety driven techniques, yoga, obviously exercising every day, going on walks, slower walks, things like that, but you name it, um, I've tried it. Um, but I just lay down in bed until 6 a.m. or the other day, for example, two days ago, went to bed at 7 a.m., then I wake up at 9 a.m. so that I can hopefully sleep the next night. So I'm just running on like two hours of sleep and it's just really frustrating and um, not good for you. But I went to my primary care doctor. Um, I'm prescribed sleeping medication, which helps, but I don't like to take it um because it's it could be habit forming and it doesn't help you improve sleep it just helps like sedate you and knock you out which i need sometimes when i really can't sleep but um visited them got my blood work done apparently i'm really b12 deficient and then i went to a naturopathic doctor which is like the more natural like i don't know they try to find natural cures and stuff for stuff stuff for stuff i don't know if i'm making sense i'm probably gonna watch this back and be like girl you're not posting this but i went to a naturopathic doctor yesterday and she thinks that it's really related with um 
cortisol levels, um, thyroid e issues, which means like I'm in fight or flight mode before bed and I'm just like, my body thinks that I'm being attacked by a lion, essentially, like heart racing, like just can't figure it out. Um, and that depletes your B12 apparently. So no wonder I don't have a lot of B12 is because my cortisol and like all these like different things are working overtime. So working on a bunch of natural type of things to figure that out hopefully. And for the people who struggle with it and have struggled with it for years, I'm so sorry. It is awful. Even one night of insomnia is terrible. I, I grew up having insomnia around my cycle and stuff. Like I would just like have a night each month where I didn't sleep and it was annoying, but like get over it. And then the past year is when it got really bad. Um, like, I've probably pulled at least 50 all-nighters in the past year. When I was in Barcelona, I don't think I like talked about it a lot because I was getting my wedding dress made and everything like that. But travel is like a big trigger for my sleep and stuff as for most people. But when I was out there, I think I was out there for five nights or six nights and I only slept one night. So out of that whole time, I didn't take one nap. I didn't sleep for even an hour. I was running on, like, I remember it was like day four. My mom was like, surely you'll go to sleep. And this was before I had medication and I, I was trying every natural melatonin, everything. And yeah, I was up for like four days in a row, no sleep. And like, if they say if you're on like, I don't know, five or six days, like you have to like go to the hospital. And I'm like, I'm tired. I'm tired. Ready to, ready for bed. I just can't fall asleep. Anyways, that's what goes on or what is going on in my life. And I don't even know if I want to post about it because I don't want to make it a thing or add to the pressure of sleep. But at this point, like I've been so MIA um, and it's because of this. Any tips or tricks are recommended. I just ordered a red light. I am working on getting a... Um, sleep therapist which um, might help that's where i've been how are you <laughs> i think i'm gonna make breakfast before it's too late it's 11 30 now so i don't want to mess my schedule up anyways this whole week i've felt kind of like a prisoner even in my own home because i'm just waiting and i'm like hopefully i sleep tonight and then i don't and then i'm up till 7 a.m but today is so beautiful it's saturday i don't really have work to do um i mean i do but i I'm not going to do any work today. Um, and I kind of just want to semi enjoy the day. I don't want to push it, but I'm just kind of over it. Sorry, this isn't my normal happy vlog, but this is uh, my full reality rate. Okay, so my latest like hyper fixation for breakfast has been these little pita. They're not huge, um, but it's just this like Mediterranean pita. Um, Dina, my best friend, she like always has these and she puts little, melts a little cheese on it and it's always so good. So I'm gonna do this and add pepper jack melted cheese and make it almost like a little like warmed up Mediterranean taco vibe, pita, whatever. Um, and I'll do some eggs and tomato and avocado in it and maybe some arugula. Added um, this avocado toast seasoning on it, it's really good. Yum, Tabasco, obviously. And I'm a hoe for arugula, so I'm just gonna add her. And then I will eat it like a little pita taco. Mm. I decided to vlog or else I was just gonna sit around all day. Are you gonna vlog at brunch? I don't know. She's nocturnal now. I only function in the evening. You're kinda of like Batman if you think about it. Thank you. Why the fuck can I not sleep? Are you gonna say fuck in your vlog? Yes. Um 
Like I like actually don't understand. I don't really know. It's like your heart is like racing when you go to bed. Is that what it is? Not last night. Issue with this whole thing is I can't blame farting in your sleep anymore on you. Cause you're just awake and you hear me the whole time. So silver lining for you. That is really funny. It literally feels like summer today. Let me show you the view. So beautiful and it's like hot air too. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm gonna try to like either do some yoga from the Peloton. I freaking love this thing by the way. I go on walks every day and I love, they have like different instructors and I use this guy Maddie, and he is so funny and we do like walk and talks where we talk about like pop culture and like things that are trending or like I don't know just like random things that happen that week so I love to like walk and listen um, but they also have yoga classes so I might explore doing one of those oh wait so I am too lazy to make an account so I use Dylan's account and I like I take like Britney Spears walking classes and stuff like that and I'll be like Dylan Barber is the only one here right now like taking the class and it's like Britney Spears pop walk like it's just like it's funny every day I send him like what I do because I do like very like girly fun like stuff and he does like the like runs and stuff like Okay, now I'm doing the quickest get ready with me ever. Um, I started doing like some meditation yoga or whatever and um, just kind of got in my feels and I needed to take a minute. I think just this whole sleep thing has me out of whack, clearly. <laughs> this whole video is gonna be like, damn, Anna, you okay? I'm fine, I'm just, I'm just out of whack. I just need to figure it out, honestly. Um, but Dylan went ahead and went to lunch with um, some of our friends and I kept going back and forth. I was like, should I go? I was just kind of in a f honestly funk. Um, and then I was sitting here and I was like, you know what? I'll just pop on a little mascara, some sunglasses. It's right down the street. So unfortunately this year my mom, I switched lighting. Hopefully this is better. I don't know if it is though. Um, but I... Sadly, I'm not spending Christmas Day with my mom this year. She has um, work like the day after Christmas. She does insurance and stuff. And um, so her and I are doing Christmas this weekend. Like yesterday we hung out. And then tomorrow I have a really fun day. Um, in the morning we, not too early in the morning, but at like 10 or 11, um, we're doing a yoga class. Um, and it's like really pretty at this hotel like resort 20 minutes away. It's like Rancho Valencia, I believe um, So we're doing that and then we're getting a couple's massage. So I am so So excited for that and I know she's gonna be excited I'm like fully surprising her like not telling her I was like just pack some like like a swimsuit and workout clothes and then I told her last night to throw her off I was like I was like, yeah, I think we'll have a really fun adventure day like and I she was like adventure. I was like, yeah, like I really try to commit with tricking people um, Like I hate giving them too many hints. So hopefully she's surprised I'm sad. She won't be going to the lake. We're going to the lake in Wisconsin, which will be really exciting um, I think we go next week like Wednesday. So I will definitely bring my camera there And my sleeping meds It's like not even funny at this point. Like it's like like me and Dylan try to like make little jokes about it because I'm so like unserious about stuff, but it's not a joke. <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> I am not okay. Anyways, I'm gonna finish getting ready really quick. It's probably as good as it's gonna get. Okay, here's my makeup. Here's my outfit. We are giving nothing. We're giving nothing today and I'm okay with that. Nope. Well, I left my camera at home. That seems like it's pretty on uh, brand for how today's going. So I'm on my iPhone. 
That's it! Woo! Okay, while I'm out here, it's so funny. There's this random poster of us, and we see it every single day, and it haunts us. It's hilarious. Okay, I'm going to my mom's now. I'm just gonna hang out with her and watch a movie. Um, but me and Bea are gonna have a night, and I'm so excited to relax. Oh, Hi! We're watching this show, Smothered, on TLC, where the mom and daughters are like obsessed with each other, and we're like, are we like that? As she's giving me a foot rub. <laughs> Anyways, make sure to like and subscribe. Um, sorry for all of the complaining today. You know, it's probably not been the most positive vlog, but it is what it is. Um, hopefully the next vlog, I'm well rested and I will definitely keep you guys updated and thank you guys for all the advice again. Um, so yeah, love you.